had conversations in the ashes, twisted words that never sounded like truth. Our heads turn around faster, our lives changing with you. You used to glide across fire, roll a blade on Jupiter's rings. You used to be a painter, becoming sharper every day and shaving off dirt on your skin. Here's the first word that you wrote. Death. He has a biblical chest, a head with two temples, and a voice like T.D. Jakes, but lately it's been quiet. A line of a man became tired of his jungle, so he decided it's time to get away, taking a vacation on the white corner of our couch. Shuttle-like goals he reaches for, and now he limits the sky. He lies on clouds and watches life pass by in a 40-inch glass screen. He's tuned in. I've seen you sit back and watch ESPN as long as I can remember, and fall asleep to the Discovery Channel. Your cup sits with oceans in the sky, tectonic plates with leftover crust that your mouth has never washed away. Across the table, there's a graveyard with tombstones marking all of your accomplishments. He's laid back so back that those two feet aren't able to stand. The pressure is forcing him to all fours like a chair, bowing down, asking God for just a spend some time with him. You. Occasionally, he brings me to this dusty chamber and he talks with me. He walks on geometric lines, making me find the point of this conversation. There is no point. But there is. It's to never give up. It's to solve the puzzle with the pieces you were given. It's to look in the depth of your pocket and grab every bit of change you have left. Pull it out and spend it on betting yourself. I hope when you sleep your eyes roll back to your mind and you remember when it was easier to say love than hate. Remember when each room in our symmetrical home had a multicolored paint. Remember when each scene had another take. Remember when we tried to speed through every red light but there was always another one coming. Just wait. Life has its ups and downs and its rights, but never let what's inside of you take a left. Never let your aspirations have an expiration date. Go to the bottom of your feet and pick up the soul you've been walking on. Reach inside your stomach and wake up that man you digested long ago. That man is hungry for God. That man is starving for a better future. Hallelujah. Free your pantry heart and feed him love. Feed him love. Feed him love. Let's act like he's all you got. Let's act like today is the beginning of the rest of our lives. Dad, it's time to get up. Mom's hollering dinner. The boys are playing catch. Your daughter won't even let you play with her. You're missing your friends. Rise, because every day you're dying. 